Hi, um, this is Shurt from Pagayo. Uh, many people have asked me why uh, can't I see the main menu in my design, in, in Magento. So that's why I created this small tutorial. Um, I have installed the responsive uh, theme, PT004, but this is uh, this feature I'm showing you is, is, is the same for this theme, but also for uh, my other themes and also for Magento in general, so it's nothing special here. Um, as you can see, um, there's no menu here, and even if you go to responsive, you see the word menu, but there's nothing there. The reason for this is that uh, there is a main menu, if you go into the backend, and you see, you go to System, Manage Stores, you will see, and this is a completely new install, so everything is uh, default. Uh, you can see that the root category is the default category. But the default category is uh, used in the front end, but it's not shown. So the trick is this. You go to Catalog, Manage Categories, and you create a category, but the category needs to be a subcategory from the default category. So um, I've added a test product here, so that's why you see the one, but there shouldn't be a product here. I just did it to, to, to show you what, what, what many people do, but it is an, actually it is an error. So there should be no product here. Okay. So again, you select default category, add a subcategory, I call it test cat, I activate it, I will give it a product. This is another feature many people forget, please always say is Angor, set it to yes and save category. So now you can see here, we have created a subcategory. And if you go to the front end now, good practice would be to first refresh your cache, always refresh your cache. Even better would be to disable it while you're working on your shop, but that's obvious. So now you go to the front end, you refresh your site and you see the menu is there. The home uh, link you see here, the blog and the, cat, the, the contact page are part of this design, so that's why they plop up. But what we just created is the test category. And in it, no products. <laughs> um, that's a good other small tutorial. Why don't I see the product? I'll show it here. It is most likely because I did not give it a quantity and also, you see, quantity is zero. So I'll give it 50 and make it in stock and save it. Cash is asking again, Cash will ask you a lot of refreshing. And you go to the front end and there's the product. Mm -hmm.